Hey everyone, Jared here, ACOC Bluestar, and welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange. So, um, I think we returned back to the main campus of the school, and I think we're gonna have our art class. So, let's get it. So, our are you going to that Vortex Club party? Like I would miss it. I have Sir? The oh, hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. No. No. Never mind. Glad to see you weren't about to accuse another student of something or other. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay, um, yeah. So we're in the school, um, I think I remember where our class was. Max, can we talk? Oh, come on. I know Stupid things security got a heated dude. yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? Oh, shoot, this will... Oh, shoot. Oh, I'll just say no and then I'll rewind. No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of a And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Okay, no consequences there, but um... Let's just head to our- okay, who's this? Is it a private number? Oh, it's Warren, hey! Okay. I anyway, guys, this ep I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. All right, I don't know where our class is. Um, so yeah, this episode will be a little bit shorter because I'm running out of space. Why? You don't understand mine. Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. Oh you boy, what is he gonna do? Is everything okay? Just between you and me. I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Oh, snap. I mean, he knows. He knows, so... I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Oh, shoot. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Oh, uh, just say everybody knows. Oh, god. Everybody knows. That's why I wanted to see you. Kate is being humiliated daily. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Man, he already knows. Come on. Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. Uh, man, this hard. It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girls' bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? 
Listen, should I? Excuse me, Max. Oh, snap. Hello. Yes? Um, uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Man, I don't know what we did wrong. It's hard. Let's do a... Let's do a quick undo. Let's do a quick undo and redo everything that we just said. We need to really think through this, guys. I... I feel like the, the consequences are, like, all coming now. Nobody does. Excuse me, Max? Me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. I really need to think. We're what if we say never mind? Not exactly. Never mind. Sorry. I have to go and work on my photo. You can talk to me anytime. And Max, can I talk to you about Kate? I assume you know about this viral video. Kate is freaked out. Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? What was the question? I'll just say no. No. I just don't want Kate Marsh to be the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about <coughs> yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. That was private. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation, Max. I hope so, Max. Listen, should I... Ex Alright, so no consequences now. So I, I don't know what we did, but um... Let's just Maybe sit down in class, I guess. Bell. Hey, Bell. Daniel? Bell. Okay. Dana, Dana you are speak to Dana. No time to talk, Turn Max. Left, Posing right. in progress. Show me the love. Do you think Max How will be I pissed for like... sitting at her desk? You look like ass. Oh, I'm sure hey, what? she'll report what do you to say? the principal. Like I give a flying f <laughs> Oh, she'll run to Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> like okay. he gives a shit. Like anybody does. Hello, Alisa. Max is such Hello. a little... Shh, what photo are we going to give her? Speak. Not now, Max. I'm contemplating. What if we give her the photo? Why would we do that? What was the point in that? Okay, um... Is that Victoria? Hold up. What are we doing? Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. And paparazzi. I want that photo or I get nasty. Too late. Oh, burn! Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. Oh gosh, the In beef fact, is still going. It's just starting, Max. No, don't do anything. I bet they're gonna pull more pranks on us. I 100% bet they're pulling more pranks on us. Like even episode, even stuff from episode one, it's still affecting us a lot in these situations, in these conversations back at school. Because if you really think about it, only one day has passed since episode one. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. I don't know what I want to feel about um, Mr. Madsen. Or the, whatever, the, 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 you know, the security. Hey, oh, hey, Warren, what's up, my dude? What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love. Wait, does Warren me, go to this if class? You're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit we'll down. See we have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. 
Usually, people need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality. It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photo tips. Oh, we didn't even get to read the book. Okay. The TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking I guess Caitlin is class now. There are a few soldiers. I'm worried about her. I want to really listen to what Mr. Jefferson's like what Max Mr. Call, Jefferson's saying. For example, who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in mind. Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girl's door! Zachary, do not come into my class like that. Ever the heck? Again. That was so random. Listen! Oh gosh. Wait, seated. what's happening? Is Nathan Prescott doing something? Dismissed. Oh man. Bro, I have a bad feeling about this. Yo, what is going on? Like, what's going on? Yo, hopefully, hopefully no one's getting beat up, bro. Yo, is it Kate? Is this for real? Flipped out. I didn't think she was that messed up. What's going on? Hey, I'm moving. All right, what's going on? Who is that up there? She can't die. She can't. Rewind. Rewind. What in the world? Not what? Again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. What are we supposed to do? Does she have to see us or something? Wait, is she able to pause in the, she's able to pause in the moment? Gosh, so Kate Marsh is committing suicide? This Keep is deep. Going Max. Oh, she has to hold herself though to keep the moment paused. Do it. Come on. Got to keep going forward. Oh my gosh. No, what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to go forward? What are we supposed to do? Do we have to like go all the way and stop her? Yeah, we have to keep our hand out like that because that's how we rewind time. Yes. Don't let go of that grip. She's gonna fall any second now. <clears throat> this game is darker and stranger than I. Don't, don't, don't. I don't care about your nosebleed. Someone's about to die. You hear me? Oh. What are you doing here, Max? Stop. Don't come near me. Not now. It won't work. I don't have any power. Now oh I gosh, have to she do ran this out. I think she myself. used too much. Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Dang, okay. she's had enough. Okay. She's fed up. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. Ooh, you should have taken the picture. If we say things will get better, nothing will happen. If we say you matter not just to me, she'll feel a sense of love, I you guess. You matter, and not just to me. I do want to believe that. <sighs> hey, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. Oh. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. I'm here for you. I'll always be here for you, Kate. My new motto is, friends come first. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always Are the people just watching like from down really there? Listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? 
I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. Oh. Gosh, all these answers are horrible to say at this time. Too dangerous. I believe for you, Kate. But it's dangerous for both of us if I get involved now. I told you exactly what happened. Well, it's too late to help, Max. Too late. Oh gosh, Mark, yes, stop. I know I screwed up. I'm sorry, Kate. Please. You don't have to do oh. this. Max, oh. I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm horny on the internet forever. Dang, she's no being tormented by web. everyone. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Ooh. If you say everybody will forget, that that's not really helpful because you'll still be tormented for at least the rest of the year. If you say there are billions of other videos, no, because you're viral right now, and there aren't billions of videos that are viral, only like a few hundred. So, be strong. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Oh. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore oh, either. I forgot she was a Christian. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. Oh, you're my friend. Okay. Okay. Forever. Can we hug on it? No. Nobody cares about me. Nobody. We care. Oh gosh, what are we supposed to say? We don't even know if she has siblings. Gosh. Let's say mother. What about your mother, Kate? You'll destroy her. She doesn't care about a video. She loves you. You don't know my mother at all. She already thinks Satan has me on the fast track to hell. Let's prove it. No! 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 Oh my gosh, what did I do? Oh. Ugh. Oh, this hurts. Can I rewind this? Wait, did she just die? Can I rewind this? My God. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us, but we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh, before she did what she did. Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police inquiry. I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. <clears throat> we need to find out why Kate Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through. But Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Ooh. Man. Could I Ms. have done Coffey, anything to save her? Why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please. No, tell us come everything. on. Could we have changed this outcome? Gosh. Like, these are all horrible choices. Gosh. If we say Nathan dosed her, if we say David bullied her, that's not enough of a thing. Jefferson made her cry, that's not enough. 
you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna stay keeping Nathan as my enemy. Um, I don't, I don't I personally don't want Mr. Jefferson and Mr. Madison to be, uh, to be my enemies because they're high. They, they have a high position. So let's say Nathan dosed her. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're a liar. The field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott Whoa. does appear prominently in the video and Ooh. was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. <sighs> Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and fellow student is dead. And they don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. He clearly right, doesn't Mr. care Garfield, at all. Please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me. But I think I can use my power again. Let's do a quick undo and run through all the choices. Oh gosh, this is this is literally killing. My gosh. Let's say what if we we say David bullied her? We're not gonna stick with this, but let's see what happens. Mr. Madsen was bullying Kate. Oh, grow Excuse up! Excuse me, I was there. I saw you getting in her face. You have no idea what you saw. Kate Marsh was involved with a bad crowd. I was trying to find out who. Kate had a double life. I was super shocked when I found out. No, you were part of the crowd. And like I said, I personally saw David physically harass Kate Marsh. You lying little Shh. Are you gonna take this junkie's word over your security officer? I know she smokes and deals what? marijuana. That has nothing to do with Kate. Max, falsely accusing other people seems to be a habit with you. I trust my security officer. Ooh, man, that's I'll not a good I'll have to investigate either. to see if this accusation is true. Therefore, Max, I'm obliged to contact your parents and suspend you for So that one's days. bad for us. Excuse it's me. even worse for us. I think Max and Nathan need a break. Please. Rewind again. Let's see the other choice. This would take a weird turn if we blame our teacher. This would take a weird turn. Miss Caulfield, why exactly? What if we say Jefferson? Jefferson made her cry is the pettiest way to respond to that. I saw Mr. Jefferson talking to Kate right before our class. Then she ran off crying. Mark, I do know that Miss Marsh has assisted you on class events. Kate, Miss Marsh has been very withdrawn lately. I assume this awful video was the cause. I hated seeing the students laugh at her. She told me Max was the only one who believed her, would take her calls and actually listen to her. She shouldn't have asked to be on video macking with some dudes. You she didn't ask for any of this. No, on the contrary. Max was right to bring this up. Hmm. Now, I wanted to help, but I guess I was too late. Well, now this is problematic. The publicity. So now you have Jefferson on our perhaps, side, I guess. You shouldn't represent Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes contest in San Francisco. Are you Ooh. serious? I am. We don't need any negative press about that event. And we need to involve the Academy in possible disciplinarian measures for you. I understand. There are bigger things at stake than me. The life of a young girl, for one. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you Okay. Man, these are all horrible. Oh, 
Okay, let, let's... I think I'm gonna stick with the one taking out Nathan... Nathan Prescott. And then we'll end off the episode. That was a really depressing episode. My gosh. Nathan Doster. All I know is that Kate was at a party and... Prescott. I've been told of this <coughs> gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them. Okay, I think this is the a best option because we get in the dead. least trouble here. And they don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. <sighs> That's tough, bro. Oh my gosh. I'm sticking with this one because we want to keep as few enemies as well, possible. Well, I think we know less now than possible. when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful this is a deep day. Game, bro. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. Yo. Yeah. This was this is the most depressing episode ever. My gosh. This is the roughest episode. If we had only taken the picture, bro. I just bro. can't believe it. It's like it wasn't even real. Watching her drop like a weight. Oh, I really thought hurts. I could save her. Like a superhero. I'm not gonna cry or anything, but like this hurts. Come on, Max. Do not for a second blame yourself. Kate was on that roof for her reasons, not yours. My hand just reached out. Stop it. You were the only one with balls enough to run to the roof. You were the only one who cared. Yeah, I sure made a big f difference. Maybe if more people cared, better people than me. You're the best person around. Warren, I screwed up today. Damn, that you makes really no did screw up, sense. bro. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but... There's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. Now, I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight up... So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? The weather confirms this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. <laughs> I believe you, Warren. I believe anything of this. Oh. Oh. Oh, this episode, oh my gosh. Oh, man. I know I screwed up. Don't flame me in the comments. I know I screwed up at several points. At the, at, the, at least three decision, decisions I screwed up. Gosh. Hopefully I don't get sadder by getting copyrighted. the lighthouse over there.
Oh, it's that guy. He's gonna be coming for our interest now. Hopefully none of us die now. there. Gosh. Alright, this episode was a roller coaster. Oh, is that the end of episode two? Ah, oh, my gosh. Oh, you, you, you could save Kate's life? You could save Kate's life? What? What? Alright guys, next episode we're gonna try to save Kate's life, alright? Maybe. We might do a full- we might try to do a playthrough without Kate, but like, oh my gosh. I might play through this game again and try to save Kate, but oh man. I feel so bad. Gosh, I'm even in the minority. I feel bad. <sighs> alright guys, that's the end of episode 2. All right. What is this? Is this chapter three? I bought the full game, don't worry, I'll play this. What the heck? We're doing an investigation? All right guys, that's the end of the episode, peace out.